Hello viewers, uh, here we are with the new edition of Energy Dialogue uh, and in this edition we are going to discuss about the 25th May episode of uh, almost zero pricing in the RTM and day ahead market during the day although it was uh, Sunday and a holiday uh, this phenomenon of zero pricing has created a lot of uh, buzz in the market that how solar as is making the energy surplus in the country whereas during the evening peak hours when there is no solar the prices go up to the roof that is 10 rupees and during evening hours the scarcity of power is evident in the summer months the main reason behind uh, this kind of uh, phenomenon which we have seen for the first time that is zero pricing is because of uh, surplus capacity during the solar hours and I will like to show you how the market has flooded with the solar capacity particularly during the solar hours when uh, you have more than 35 gigawatt of additional solar capacity available in the market whereas the requirement is only to the extent of 5 to 7 gigawatt in the market and thereby uh, the, because of the supply demand curve, the prices do crash and as because there is no floor price, it touches zero and doesn't go below that. And uh, this phenomenon may not be a normal thing. Solar certainly is a good thing for the country and it is happening very well. But three important things which I would like to mention here is we require a lot of BSS or the battery storage. Uh, along with this, there need to be a review of things that whether the solar need to be a master run plan and last but not the least, uh, with the procurement of solar capacities by the DISCOM, uh, there must be a hybrid kind of a solution available to them so that they not only meet the during the day, but the demand during the evening peak hours also are met. So thank you viewers and we will be coming with new issues. Uh, in our next round of energy data.